I ran away from home. Do you mind if I live with you? Live with me? My goodness, I feel like I'm gonna pinch myself to see if I'm dreaming. Hot dog, it's real! Mr. Herbert, it's six o'clock. I'm, I'm not really tired yet. Well, you had those three cups of NyQuil. You'll be down soon enough. Okay. Good night, Mr. Herbert. Sweet dreams, Chris. Mr. Herbert, what's life really all about? Well, I suppose it's about trying new things, sampling the sweet and the savory, not being afraid to take everything life wants to throw up on into you. Wow, I never looked at it like that before. Thanks, Mr. Herbert. But don't you think it's scary to try new things? No, Chris. Life is like a new baseball glove. At first, you think you're never going to get a ball in there. But then you oil it up, work your fingers around in there a little, and pretty soon you're pitching and catching. I guess that makes sense. Sorry. You really know how to waste a Cialis, don't you? Chris, what did you do with my videotapes? I had a whole system. I was trying to find a good movie to watch. I've never even heard of most of these. Jeffrey at the Park? Mikey's Scoliosis Exam? Nephew Somersault Compilation? Well, even if you never heard of them, I assume you heard of the alphabet. You want to explain to me how Sammy Popsicle comes before napping various? Geez, I'm sorry. Well, can we watch Lost Boys? I've heard of that one. Those? Those are different Lost Boys. I thought I told you to clean up in here. And why aren't you dressed? We're supposed to have dinner with Judge Maynard and Timmy. Yeah, okay. As soon as I finish this level. No. Get your coat on. It's a three-hour drive to that cabin. Can you just cook something here? Excuse me? I am not going to cook you dinner while you sit here in your own mess playing your TV games. Oh, and the martyr returns. Chris, I... I think it's time for you to go. Okay, I'll go. But I want you to know, I faked all my lightheadedness. Mmm, good Kool-Aid. Whoa, whoa. Sound familiar? Bye. <laughs>